Well, in the last 10 meetings on the gridiron, Bemidji and Brainerd have written the perfect script of what a true rivalry looks like. A 5-5 split right down the middle with games coming down to the wire in the fourth quarter. Did you expect anything different from the meeting Saturday? Pivotal matchup for both teams, each sitting at 2-2 two two on the season. And let's fast forward to the second quarter. Game tied at 7. Max Zimmerman is going to take it into the house from 12 yards out. Warriors up by a touchdown early. Jacks, though, respond in suing drive. Jake Bieberg fakes it to Caleb Grant instead. Kelvin Faust with the ball, 19 yards for the score, and we're all tied at 21. Then back to Brainerd, Sam Miller time. Finds Max Bourne across the middle of the field. He tumbles in for six more. Warriors retake the lead by a score again. The homecoming crowd, they were loving it, but the Jacks kept responding. Have we seen this play before? If it's not broke, don't fix it. Mr. Foss again, this time from 52 yards, and it's 21 all. The legend Ron Stolsky thinking, how do we stop these guys from scoring? Well, after trailing the entire game, Bemidji finally takes the lead with less than six minutes left. Alec White is in, and the visitors are up by three, but Stolsky and Brainerd write the perfect end of the homecoming script. Charlie Garrett's come on down. You get to play here, a one-yard score. That ended up being your game winner, and what a game it was, back and forth. But the Warriors grinded out 47-43 and moved to 3-2 and two on the season. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.